Hello everyone, what's up, and welcome to Silent Fields No More Heroes Let's Play! Alright, so we just paid our way to rank number 7, and apparently we just got a message. Through snail mail. <laughs> Dear Travis, the next ranker is one dangerous dude, but there's no going home now. You set foot on the path of a real man. No amount of tears can wash away that... Uh, wash up that choice. Ah, whatever. Now hurry to the subway, get on the train, and find him waiting. Put your life on the line. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, so it is just your rank seven is now open, so I went ahead and just sped this up. Okay, so just go down the main street here. And of course just look at your radar as well. You can see the seven Roman numeral over here by the subway entrance Destroy station. Man. Come and get some. Come and get some from Destroy Man. Yeah dude! Totally rocket! <coughs> Yeah. Anyway. Uh, Alright, so... First off, head to the left and get your first card already. Card number 16. And then go ahead and head into the checkpoint here. Because of course once you go through the checkpoint you can't go back, so then you'll miss card number 16. And then after that, go ahead and go down the stairs here. And then just go forward, but just a little past the checkpoint, to the next chest here to get the next card, I believe. Yep. Sweet. Number 17. And then the subway will come and pick you up. So as you can see, you'll be finding a few people here on the subway. In the subway cars. Mm. All right, first off, when you're ready, head to the door. And first you just has normal pipe, as you can see. All right, second door, couple dudes here. And you see it's a lot easier to just charge up your beam and uh, do a low speed attack or a low charge attack. I forget the name of the moves, but you can see what I'm doing here. Oops. Yeah, it helps you go through a lot quicker. After that, just charge up real quick. Right, men. <laughs> anyway. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Alright, and you just keep going, going car through car. Isn't too difficult though. But just kind of keep in mind on how you're killing these dudes as well, because I believe later on there's going to be a either an assassination gig or a free fight mission or something of the sort where you will have to uh, go to the subway again. I forget exactly what, but yeah. See, that should. Okay, well, one more. Four. Okay, yeah, that should that should have been the last one. So. <sighs> yeah. Yeah, I just got back from Albuquerque today. No, of course, well, when I'm saying this, it's uh, let's see, what's the date? November second. But, I don't know if I'm going to be putting this video up first, like uploading it, or maybe a Kingdom Hearts video, or maybe, oh no, probably not a Grand Theft Auto video, but, either this one or Kingdom Hearts, but if it is this one, then, it's probably going to be a while from today's date, November 2nd, because, as I said, or as I had put on my, uh, profile, that the internet got turned off because of the whole economy, and parents not making as much money, but, so whenever you see this uploaded, that means you know we're getting back on our feet. And blah blah blah. blah. Yeah. So anyway, so now we got how many cards was that? Let's see, 16, 17, 18, 19, four cards. Yeah, I don't have a calculator in my head. All right, I have to count on my fingers, even for something that small. It kind of sucks. It's kind of embarrassing, but yeah. But hey, whenever it comes to memorizing lines and stuff for like say plays or movies, I'm really good at that. It's just whenever it comes to memorizing equations and 
Yeah, I, I, I just suck at math in general. Okay, and there's a health pickup if you need it, but I think you should be okay. I think your health re regenerates, but just in case, it's there if you need it. So now we are in a movie studio. Here's all the studio lot. See, there are these dudes with swords and melee attacks and pretty much all different types of weapons. But they all have bags over their, their heads, kind of like uh, Manhunt. Kind of reminds me of Manhunt. Oh, by the way, I mean, like I said, I don't know how long it's going to be until I close this up, so it, the game will probably already be out, but I just got a text message from G4 saying that Manhunt 2 it's going to be re-released for the PC, but it's going to be an adults-only version. So if you remember the original Manhunt 2 for the Wii, and I guess, I forget if it comes out, came out for other systems, but uh, it was rated mature and it had all this stupid... It was like someone vomited every time you do some like major kill. So you, you couldn't see the screen whenever it's like, I don't know, snap the neck or toss someone's head off or, you know, smash their brains out with a brick or a rubber ducky. So, you know, you, you couldn't see the screen, but apparently on the free release, that's going to be taken off and you'll be able to see everything, which is going to be awesome. Yeah, can't wait. I, I think I'm, I'm thinking actually I'm going to buy that because I hate buying games that are re-released with added content, like the bully, like I bought the original game, oh yeah, after you exit this warehouse, I think it's the first warehouse, go to the left here, a little bit, to the west, get the fifth card, fifth and final card, card number 20, I missed that the first time on my playthrough, but yeah, anyway, so just go into the next warehouse and kill them all, but where were they? Oh yeah, uh, with the bully, like, I had ordered the special edition, uh, like pre-ordered it from GameStop, and so that's the version I had, that's the version I used whenever I did my Let's Play. Um, but w then I heard, you know, Scholarship Edition came out, and I was a bit upset with that, but I heard that there wasn't really much different, just a few extra missions and um, better graphics. But I guess in the mission, you know, aren't too difficult, so you should be able to get through them without my help, and I don't think there's any extra collectibles, so you should still have no problem getting 10% if you've got the scholarship edition. Oh yeah, and as you see, with the, uh, what was it, dark side mode, it lasts twice as long. Now that we got that one upgrade from Mr. Lovikov. Uh, yeah, usually the same thing in here is just all mindless hack and slash killing, but hey, it's fun because blood goes everywhere. Like I said, it kind of reminds me of a, a Kill Bill. You remember that movie, uh, whenever it had Lucy Liu's character? And the guy said something about her family or whatever, and she ran on the table, flushed his head off, and then just like a freaking gush of blood just came out of it, and <laughs> that was so awesome. I love that. I can't wait to see the second game of this comes out. But, I, of course, I can't buy any games yet because I don't have a job. I haven't had a job for quite a while, not since, uh, July? Yeah, I haven't had a job since July. And I'm trying to get a job over at Petco. Where the pets go? Ah. But, you know, I love animals, so hopefully that'll work out. 
And if not, then maybe JC Tinnies or Target or something like that. You know, just whatever. But I'd really try and for Petco first. Either as a Stealth Sophia or a Dog Trainer. So, let's hope that works out. Oh, come on. There we go. Of course, uh, it's already passed. Oh, yeah, it's already passed 10 minutes. So, I'm actually going to have to be cutting this off pretty soon. And I'm going to have to continue on yeah, in the next video with more mindless healing. But hopefully, the next video should be the last of it. Um, one or two more videos should be for the uh, last of rank 7, I guess you could say. Yeah. Anyway, so, uh, talk to you all then. Peace out. Yeah!